Good morning students. Today we will discuss number line. So see children, number line. Representation of integers on line is called number line. So see children, representation of integers on line is called number line. This is the figure of number line. This is the figure of number line. And on arrows are available on both sides of the number line. This is first arrow and this is second arrow. Means arrows are available on both sides of the number line. This is 0. This 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. These are positive integers. This minus 1, minus 2, minus 3, minus 4, minus 5. These are negative integers. Now see children. This side is known as right side of the number line. And this side is known as left side of the number line. So see children. If you go right hand side on the number line. See, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, then numbers are decreasing. Means if you go right side on number line, then numbers are increasing. And if you go left hand side of the number line, see, 2, 1, 0, minus 1, minus 2, minus 3. If you go left hand side on number line, then numbers are decreasing. Means on number line, if you go right hand side, then numbers are increasing. So see, increasing I will turn here. And if you go left hand side on number line, then numbers are decreasing. So on number line, if you go right hand side, then numbers are increasing. And on number line, if you go left hand side, then numbers are decreasing. Now we will discuss one point which is related with number line. See children, on number line, the integer which is available right side is greater than the integer which is available left side. Means on number line, the integer which is available right side is always greater than the integer which is available left side. Means right side integer is always greater than the integer which is available left side on number line. So on number line, the integer which is available right side is always greater than the integer which is available left side. So see children, 1 and 3. So 3 is available right side of the 1. So 3 is greater. 0 and 4. So 4 is available right side of the 0. So 4 is greater. Minus 2 and 1. 1 is available right side of the minus 2. So 1 is greater. Minus 4 and minus 3. Minus 3 is available right side of the minus 4, so minus 3 is greater. In short, on number line, the integer which is available right side is greater than the integer which is available left side. This I can explain with the help of the few examples. See, 2 and 3, this is 3. 2 and 3, see 2 here and 3 here. 3 is available right side of the 2, so 3 is greater. So 3 is greater. 0 and 5, 0 and 5. See, 5 is available right side of the 0. So, 5 is greater. Means, on number line, the integer which is available right side is always greater than the integer which is available left side. Second, minus 2 and 0. So, minus 2 here and 0 is here. 0 is available right side of the minus 2. So, 0 is greater. Then 5 and minus 4. So 5 here and minus 4 here. 5 is available right side of the minus 4. So 5 is greater. Then minus 4 and minus 3. Here first you think minus 4 is greater. But minus 4 is not greater. Minus 3 is greater. See here. Minus 4 here and minus 3 is here. Minus 3 is available right side of the minus 4. So minus 3 is greater. Then minus 2 and minus 1. Again here you can think minus 2 is better. But minus 2 is not better. Minus 1 is better. But see here. This minus 2 and minus 1. Minus 1 is available right side of the minus 2. So minus 1 is greater. Minus 2 and 0. Minus 2 here and sorry. Minus 2 and 4. So minus 2 is here and 4 is here. 4 is available right side of the minus 2. So 4 is greater. Now we can discuss three points which are related with number line. Point number one. 
zero is lies right side of all the negative integers so zero is greater than all the negative integers here zero is greater than all the negative integers why zero is greater than all the negative integers see because zero is available right side of all the negative integers see these are the negative integers and zero is here zero is available right side of all the negative integers so zero is greater than all the negative integers second point all the positive integers are lies right side of all negative integers so positive integers are greater than negative integers why all positive integers are greater than all negative integers because all positive integers are lies right side of all the negative integers see these are the positive integers they are available right side of all the negative integers so positive integers are greater than negative integers because all positive integers are available right side of all the negative integers so all positive integers are greater than all negative integers point number 3 all positive integers are lies right side of the zero so positive integers are greater than zero why positive integers are greater than zero because all positive integers are available right side of the zero see 1 2 3 4 by these are the positive integers and they are available right side of the zero so all positive integers are greater than zero because all positive integers are available right side of the zero so see children this is the explanation of number line i hope you can understand this thank you